because your teammate is the champion. You said you won't fight him. This is good problem to have. Like, you no, know, we are we are cleaning division, and and that's that's a good feeling. Bad idea for Marab to go down that path. You've made no secret that you don't love it when a guy doesn't want to fight his teammate. And Marab is clear that he will not fight Aljamain Sterling and he'll wait until Aljo moves up. So what do you do with him, right? Because you don't necessarily want to put him against other contenders, knock off other contenders before they can fight for the title. So what do you do with Marab? It's so funny you say that because I don't remember who the hell I was talking to the other day about this. And I was like, yeah, we don't have to deal with that bullshit anymore. Uh, you know, back in the early days, the camps were so small, you didn't have a lot of different options. So we had a lot of these guys saying, oh, he's my friend, he's my friend. You can still be friends and want what your friend has, you know what I mean? Um, it would be a really bad idea for Marab to go down that path. Is there a point where you sort of say, right, that's enough, you have a decision to make or you have to move divisions or what do you do with him? Yeah, so, so does Marab want a shot at the title or would Marab rather have people under him jump over him and him have to take on all these different, different tough guys when he's not even getting a title shot when he's next in line for it? That's a personal decision that he needs to make. If that's what he wants to do, I can tell you how that story ends. It's not, it's not a good ending to that story, but he's a big boy. He can figure that out on his own.